So now I'm going to be fitting coax cable onto a uh, face plate. This is the um, tools I'm going to be using. I've got a couple of posi drive screwdrivers, they're uh, different sizes. Got my snips here, Stanley blade. This is the coaxial cable itself, which is um, already in the back box going up to the loft. And then I've got the face plate and the screws to attach it. Now the process for the coaxial cable itself is you want to go about an inch down, score all the way along the cable with your knife. And then remove the end. Now you'll be left with um, this braid. So you want to just pull that back and twist it at the end. And just keep that out of the way for now. And then there's some foil around here. You just want to pull that down and tear that off. And then we're now left with this um, plastic sheath here um, with the coaxial cable inside. So what I want to do is I want to get the back of my face plate and I want to roughly measure up where I need to cut. So this brace will hold um, the braid in, in place. So the coaxial cable will be roughly positioned like this. So what I need to do is ensure that the, the cable itself is actually going into the center pin here. So I need to cut um, just about here, where my finger is, uh, and then expose a bit of the wire here. Right, so I've cut my um, cable down to size. Um, and now what I need to do is just score with the Stanley blade um, just around the bottom of this um, plastic sheath, not too far down, just enough to expose a bit of the cable to fit it inside here. So I'm just going to score around just, um, just a couple of mil down really. And then that should just twist off. Now, going back to my face plate, um, you can see I can get the coaxial cable underneath this brace. With the top of the coaxial cable that I exposed is just inside of this center pin and the brace is in place. And now I can screw all that up. Okay, so the cable is all in place now. The brace is tightened up. The center screw is tightened up. Just got a bit of the, um, the braiding left here. So I'm just gonna tidy that up a little bit. And that's it done. All that's left now is to um, pull, pull some of the slack here up into the loft. We'll get into the loft to do that. Uh, I've made sure I've got plenty of slack. Uh, and then attach um, the faceplate to the wall 